Hi, this is No Ordinary Voice of Spiritual Ventriloquism. You are listening to the dummy himself. Well, uh, it's a good thing I'm not monetizing these videos. <laughs> or I'd probably have everyone crying and whining about it. This is the non-sexy version of what comes to your dinner plate. Uh, this is a Katahdin sheep uh, who was stunned and... Uh, and then subsequently a kosh root kill, obviously. Uh, this first thing you want to do when you put one down is you want to uh, hit, the, hit the throat so that it bleeds out properly, okay? And uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to field dress this sheep. So I'm going to hand the camera over to my daughter for a second and I'm going to show you how to field dress a sheep, deer, goat, whatever. Uh, it's all the same thing. Here, Tirza, if you don't mind. Now it's good. It's good to have a, a good sharp knife. This one's not as sharp as I prefer to have it. Um, I like my knives razor sharp. This one's probably 75%. Maybe. Feels pretty good. Okay, first thing we want to do, we're not going to worry about getting it ready to hang. We're going to field dress. Now what we do is you uh, come to the back end of the animal right here, just below the, uh, the vaginal opening and rectum. And you make it a little slit right there. Okay. Then what you do is you hold the skin, kind of pull the skin taut to you. Try to keep in the center as much as possible. Okay. And follow up to the breastbone. You don't have to worry about punching the gut bag at this point. You just follow it up to the to the breastbone. Okay. And uh, I continue to. Uh, to go ahead and continue to make that cut all the way up to the throat where I bled the animal out. Okay, now that we got our line traced out, we're going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you. Now you go down below the subcutaneous membrane, same thing. You're, what you're trying to do is you're trying to find a layer of muscle right there just before the stomach. Okay. It's a little layer of muscle that lines the stomach, all right? And what you're trying not to do is you don't want to punch all the way through that. This is a ewe about 10 months old that was donated or given to us as an offering by Brother Willie in Mississippi. I know he don't want credit for it, but he's going to get it anyway. A beautiful uh, offering. Uh, we fed this thing out on about a 16% ration. Uh, as you can see, she's got... She's been well fed. She's got a nice layer of fat on her. For a female, she's doing pretty good. Now this is the where it gets tricky. Up here at the breastbone, you want to uh, you want to cut through it. Keep your knife as level as possible. There's cartilage in the middle of that breastbone, and you can continue to split that bone with a knife. Now they say there you go. They say you can. Uh, you can butcher an animal completely with no saw. I like using the saw, but anyway. Uh, so there we go. Now we're going to come back to this area where we started, and we're going to continue to uh, to slice it right there. There's the end of it. There's the the pelvic.